Hi guys, it's me, Teacher Gon. In our today's video, we will talk about this problem. At yung problem natin is, what is 3% of 15? Or in other words, pinapahanap sa atin, gano'n ba kalaki yung number na 3% ng 15? By the way guys, uh, this is our official marker. We have the Sharpie. This video is sponsored by Sharpie. So if you want to buy their products, meron tayong links na kanilang online shop sa Sharpie and Lazada sa ating description box. So without further ado, let's do this topic. So we have here 3% of 15. So basically guys, if we want to find 3% of 15, we will try to multiply 15 by 3%. So it will, it will look like this. 3% times 15. Pero hindi ito yung proce uh, tunay na process natin. Because hindi mo pwedeng i-direct na i-multiply si 3% by 15. First thing you need to do is to convert this 3% into a decimal value. So try natin convert yung ating 3%. Okay? So in 3% natin is equivalent to 0 0.03 in decimal form. O sir, paano po natin nagawang 0 0.03 yung ating decimal yung ating 3% in decimal form? Remember ha, when we are converting a decimal from a percentage, dito nag start yung ating, ano, yung ating decimal point. And then, we will move this decimal point two units ha, or two decimal places from right to left. Again, ilang beses ko nang inulit to, yung conversion natin is from right to left. Here, one and two. Dito mag-stop yung ating decimal point at ilalagay natin dito yung zero. Tapos 0. So we have 0 0.03. That's why meron tayo itong 0 0.03. Now let's continue. We have 0 0.03 times 15. So what's next sir? Ang gagawin natin ngayon dito is that we will multiply this number 0 0.03 times 15. So 3 times 5 or 5 times 3 that is 15. Carry 1. 5 times 0 is 0 plus 1, that is 1. Then, 5 times 0 is 0. Next, 1 times 3 is 3. 1 times 0 is 0. 1 times 0 is 0. And then, let's add them. This is 5. 1. Plus 3. This is 4. Bring down 0 and 0. And remember to count the number of decimal value na meron tayo. Decimal places na meron tayo. We have 1 and 2. That's why dito yung ating decimal place. So, ang answer natin dito is simply 0 0.45. Ibig sabihin guys, when we multiply 0 0.03 by 15, that is equal to 0 0.45. This is the correct answer here guys. But, syempre, mag-iintroduce ako sa inyo another way on how to do this. Remember, we have 3% of 15. Ako, ang gagawin ko rito, another method na gagawin ko rito, is I will try to get the 1% of 15. Okay, review muna tayo. Ang 10% ng 15, 10% of 15 is equal to 1.5. Ang nangyari, itong 15 natin, since 10% ang pinapanap sa atin, imove ko lang siya ng 1 decimal point. Kaya siya naging 1.5. Again, kapag 10% ang kinuha natin na 15, imove ko lang siya ng 1 decimal point from right to left. Yun yung shortcut ko. Eh, ang target ko kasi ngayon dito is kunin yung 1%. Sir, bakit po kailangan kunin yung 1%? Kasi, ang 1%, Para makuha natin 3%, kapag nakuha ko yung value ng 1%, imumultiply ko lang siya sa 3. Yun ay magiging sagot natin. So ngayon, kung 1% ang hinahanap ko, kanina, kung 10% ang hinahanap ko, nag-move ako ng 1 decimal point from right to left, kung 1% naman ang hahanapin ko ng 15, from this point, mag-move ako ng dalawa. Isa, dalawa. That's why, yung ating 1% is equal to 0 0.15. Nakuha ko ba yun? Ibig sabihin guys, Kailangan ko lang ng tatlong 1%, isa pang 1%, 
para makuha ko yung value ng 3% of 15. And let me add them. 5 plus 5 plus 5, this is 15. Carry 1. 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1, this is 4. And as you can see, still, the answer is 0 0.5. So I hope guys na natuto kayo sa mismong video natin on how to get the 3% of 15. And sana ma-apply nyo kung ano yung tinuro ko rito gamit yung iba pang value or iba pang problem. So let me challenge you and answer this problem. What is the 5% of 20? So, bye-bye!